I think that that's how you design uh, programs and services at colleges because mm -hmm. you really need the student's voice. And people need to hear the student's voice to remember why we're doing the work that we're doing. Sometimes I think we forget why we're doing the work that we're doing, um, but when we hear student voices, it brings it all back. And it makes it very real, very salient about the, the challenges that we face, but also the successes, right? Yeah. It, it can motivate us. It makes us feel like, okay, I'm doing the right thing. Sometimes as presenters, we kind of gloss over the data and we can make assumptions about things, but having the actual students in the program here is what it's really all about. We felt it was really important to bring student co-presenters to these presentations for several reasons. The first is that um, it's really important as we're form formatting anything that has to do with the community colleges, making decisions for us to hear the student voice, to make sure that everything that we're doing is actually aligned with what you need as a community college student. Um, I think we do that fairly well at the college, and we wanted to make sure to have an opportunity for our colleagues from other colleges to hear directly from students and to make sure that they do the same within their colleges as well. Secondly, I think it's an excellent opportunity, right, for students to co-present as well because you develop your professional skills, you enhance your um, networks across the colleges as well, um, and then you see what it's like to be a professional as well. What we're really looking at is if we are striving to make change across these campuses, our student voices need to be at the table. So in the power of having students at the front of the room communicating with administrators, faculty, staff, their stories matter. Their narratives are powerful. And statistics and data tell one part of the story, but not the entire picture. So what is beneath the surface of that? How can we depict the urgency of having students at the front of the table?